Hello, YouTube. In today's video, it's going to be another medical video. I have two appointments today, the first of which being with my primary doctor, and I usually see him anywhere from once, like every other week, or at least once a month at the very minimum. Lately, since I've been like acutely sick with the C. diff and some other stuff going on, I've been seeing him more frequently just to make sure that um, I don't get myself in a situation to decline and become any sicker than I've already been. And then the second appointment is with my OBGYN, and that might sound like really weird. I've been seeing her, um, so I'm not, not pregnant or anything, obviously. I'm seeing her more frequently, mainly because I've had some hormone imbalances, um, one of which being estrogen and a few other things, um, that were way off for the age that I am. So we've been pursuing kind of some treatments um, and different natural options to correct those issues. Um, but I haven't seen her in three months. We've been trying out some different meds in the meantime. So I'm gonna see her, we're gonna reevaluate things. I am in like a different room today, if you can't tell here. Um, I got dropped off at Derek's parents' house this morning and then in a little bit here, um, Georgia and Daxon and I are gonna drive to drop me off at my appointments. My mom is meeting me there at the appointment and then Derek will be picking me up afterwards. But we're gonna get those two appointments out of the way and then depending on scheduling and everything, um, there is a chance I'm gonna need a CT scan since my belly pain has been not very well controlled. So seeing my primary doctor whom I love, seeing the my OBGYN doctor who handles like my hormone issues and then um, possibly a CT scan just to look and see what's going on and if we need to do anything now between today and next Monday when I see the GI doctor who will be doing that procedure and I just want to get better so please believe with us and pray for us that we have the best of results so we can move forward with this new like cutting, a cutting edge procedure that they do for people with C. diff and it's so successful. God, God is so good, honestly. I do believe that I can have healing without doctors, procedures, medications. However, I also believe that God created the people who invented these procedures or did the research. Like he makes each and every one of us have our own talents, our own gifts. And I wholeheartedly believe that God created the people who then became doctors or, you know, went into the medical research realm or, you know, in, in even the pharmaceutical industry. Like, it truly is um, a blessing to have that. So I, you know, I am a Christian and I also have chronic illness and I do take medications. However, I know that everything here on this earth was made because God created the earth. He created us. So. When I think of it that way, it really makes me feel a lot better. <laughs> um, and it really makes me feel appreciative for the doctors that I do work with and the ones, the nurses out there and the CNAs and the NPs and the PAs and med students and pharmacists and on and on and on because, you know, all of that is a product of the world that God gave us and the people he created. And that is so special to think. So. I'm believing for God for total healing and I know that could happen any given time. It could be this instant, it could be five seconds from now, it could be a year. Some people it's a longer road, it can be years, but you know what? I'm still believing for that and in the process while I'm, while that healing is working on inside of me, I'm thanking God for the medications I do have and the doctors and care staff that I do have because it is a blessing and it's not anything that I take for granted. You know, all glory to Him in all of this. Um, He's kept me alive, the prayers have kept me alive. Your guys' support and prayers, like it it doesn't go unnoticed. I'm gonna get emotional, which I don't like to do on video. Um, yeah, I just, it's been so hard, but I'm so much better than I was. And you know, um, God's good. I'm getting better, you guys. And I know you guys don't get to see it all, but even if you look in our older videos, like, I feel so blessed and so loved and supported and honestly, what more can you ask for? It's a blessing. Blessing to live, blessing to have doctors, be able to afford medication and, you know, have family help out during this time and uh, 
and to get back on YouTube and just know the outpouring of support that I have from you guys and many of you I don't even know I've never met so it it means the world it really does and I'm gonna get off here because no one wants to watch someone cry it's happy tears but I've come so far but I haven't come so far to only come so far if that makes sense we appreciate all of the new subscribers and the ones who have been with us since day one and have seen you know Derek and I's life prior to even being pregnant and then while being pregnant and then everything that unfolded after having and delivering Daxon um, and it's just been it's been up and down in the hills and the valleys and you know God didn't say there was there just because you're a Christian or you follow him that you're not gonna have trials like it tells us it's biblical the trials will come tribulations will come but how do you work to get through those I am going to be at the clinic for a good four four and a half hours today so I'm gonna go and spend some time with my adorable precious little baby who is another miracle all on himself um, I'm just so in awe of him and the fact that I have a baby um, was able to you know live through that experience with the conditions we didn't know I had and yeah I'm gonna spend time with him before I have to go there because while it is a blessing to go, it's never fun to spend hours away from those you love. So I'm going to go enjoy some time with him. Once we are in the car en route, I will check back in with you guys. Bye. Are we going for a ride? You like the camera? Are you bringing mama to her appointment? Yay! In here. So, just got done at Ardolph's office appointment. I always come in this room. And this is the best part. And the best part is he loves dogs, but this is like Stella on here. Stella's cuter, this one's strangly, but still it's a burner. How cute is that? Yeah. More meds, refills. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> okay, so I just got done at my appointment. It's kind of weird vlogging here. It's a giant doctor's office. All my medications. Would you look at this? So many. Hey. Oh. How's it going there, YouTube? <laughs> I didn't even get to really get any footage in the doctor's rooms because, ooh, it's about to storm, guys. So, wow. yeah. So I got a car wash, which is really good because we haven't washed this vehicle, this vehicular, in about a year, <laughs> six months. No, not Come a year. Not that that bad. No, we got it back in winter, so probably January. We're about to get some weather, so we're gonna work our way home here, and then we will check back in a little bit. Right on. So, if you guys can hear me, just trying to get home. We've been in the car for close to an hour. Mm -hmm. It's getting darker by the minute. Jeez. Okay. So we made it through the storm. We came home and the hubby made, he's hiding over here. Doggos. Tacos. Mm. I'm gonna do is eat a taco here. The hubby's making me one. I'm gonna eat that. I'm gonna like lay down on the couch, take my medicine, get some of my IV stuff going. And I'm gonna call it a night. You gotta know your limits and I'm hitting mine for the day and that's okay. That's the beauty of vlogging. So just like this, technology. Am I right? So, with that being said, please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed the medical update or taking you guys with me along to my appointments. Really, really appreciate it. I love feeling the love from you guys, so give it a thumb up. Thumbs up, it helps our channel grow. Subscribe down below if you have not already. We would love to have you join the doll family. And then make sure to also click that bell so that you can be notified whenever we post new videos. 
but you guys don't want to miss out on any of the fun shenanigans that we go on here in the Dolph Dam or any of the medical updates that I have to give. Our Instagrams are always linked down below so you can give them a follow. Thanks guys, love you, peace.